parents with nanny cams, what have you caught your babysitter doing? We have a security camera in my bedroom for my free roam bunny so we can keep an eye on her whilst on work. If we go on holiday ECT. Well my dad is 50 and is a big bloke who acts like he doesn't like pets came over to visit one day whilst I was out. He went in my room and crouched down calling the bunny. He spent an hour trying to pet the rabbit and kept repeating in a soft voice I'm not going to hurt you. I just want to pet you and see how fluffy you are. He just about shit himself when I spoke through the security camera to tell him she's very fluffy. Chasing my cats around with a broom. Hitting them. She's since been fired. A friend caught his nanny hitting their kid for interrupting that day's binge of the TV show Friends. My aunt has a nanny cam and found my older cousin's babysitter playing blackjack with him. She lost $50 lol. My family bought one to see our dogs when we leave on vacation twice a year. It's one where they can hear us and we thought IDs be great we hardly used it. We also asked our maid to dog sit for us while we were out. Once when we looked at the feed we saw the dog sitter there a solid 30 minutes early just petting the dogs and playing with them. She's since retired from working, but she was the sweetest old lady and we love her. Another time my dad left a wad of cash on top of the washing machine about $600 and she put a rubber band around it with a note saying he misplaced it. We once caught the nanny putting charcoal to feed them as a snack. This woman claimed that she thought it was a snack. It was in a charcoal box. My brothers were four. We didn't have a nanny cam, but my mom set up the camcorder when she suspected our babysitter was stealing, and then caught the babysitter stealing. She returned most of the stuff when my mom threatened to report her to the police. I think she should still have reported her anyway. Now she probably just went on stealing at other people's places. I think she learned her lesson. Next time the camcorder will be stolen at first. My story isn't that interesting but I have a camera to check in on my rabbit when I'm not there. The biggest surprises were mostly just how almost nobody followed my pet sitting instructions. The one exception, ironically, was my brother who claimed to hate the rabbit and always wanted to get rid of it. I got an alert one day that my camera had detected movement while my bro was there taking care of him and I decided to take a peek. I opened the app connected to the camera and saw my bro walk into my room, lay on the floor, and start playing with my rabbit. It just warmed my heart. Not me but my aunt's friend set up a nanny cam because she noticed that every time she changed her child's diaper the child would start crying a lot more than usual. Turns out when they watched the nanny change her diaper, she would use Clorox wipes if they were nearby instead of grabbing the baby wipes. Watched her outside playing with my dog she was dog sitting. Our yellow Labrador and golden retriever puppy started munching the blueberries right now off our blueberry bushes. They know damn well they're not supposed to get into the blueberry patch. We watched our dog sitter run over to them and try to get them to stop. She then ran inside and ran back out with a bowl. She proceeded to race the dogs for the blueberries. Had to be one of the highlights of our trip. We came home to a bowl of blueberries in the fridge and two very guilty puppers. I'm not a parent rather the child and I had this nanny, or yaya as we would call it. It became useless because she soon found out and kept unplugging the camera. It turns out she was slowly stealing money from my family. We fired her. Friends of ours don't have kids but have dogs. They were going out of town and told the dog sitter about all of the cameras including the one that is outside but sometimes picks up reflections and will actively notify them of motion. The dog sitter seemed to get it but she forgot to convey that to her boyfriend who came out and walked around naked quite a bit. The dogs were naked. 2. Fair's fair. This isn't something that I caught a babysitter doing but I remember that I once saw on TV the case of some parents that went with her baby to the doctor because she cried a lot for apparently no reason. The doctor told them that she looked really stressed and asked them if they were doing something that could make her act like that. They didn't. Then the doctor and the parents noticed some really tiny dots in the girl's belly and they had no idea where they came from. The babysitter told them that she had no idea but they didn't believe her and secretly put cameras to spy what she was doing. Turns out that she was crazy. She was stabbing the baby with a needle from time to time and doing things like shaking her cradle incredibly hard to torment her. Of course. They called the police. Confronted her and she got arrested. 
I have Rover sitters come in, nothing weird, but honestly, if I pay you $30 to play with my dog for an hour I expect more than you sitting on my couch in your phone while my dog tries to get your attention to play with him, ugh. The couple I sat for had a nanny cam in their living room, the kind that went in bears. They got me on video giving the two yo the Heimlich after he tried to eat a rock. My uncle told me this once when a babysitter was holding his daughter my older cousin when she was a baby. The baby was playing with her toys and she somehow swallowed a small piece of something and the babysitter performed the Heimlich but for babies there's a version of that for babies I don't know where I found it though. She saved my cousin and her family was thankful. They have no idea where the babysitter is now but right now she's supposed to be around her late 40s. I was the one caught in camera a few times. A family who had bunnies caught me on camera booping noses to the beat of the song I was singing. Little bunny foo foo hopping through the kitchen. A different family saw me get f tackled by the 95 pounds mastiff puppy. And they immediately called me to make sure I didn't have a concussion since I just kinda laid there for a while. I was fine. I just got the wind knocked out of me. Yet another different family saw me reading a book to their kids. And later complimented all the voices I make. I had no idea they could hear audio and I got so embarrassed. Since I really did go all out. I dog sit for some neighbors. One of which told me she has a camera in the living room, dining room for her dogs. You know those ones that dispense treats. Anyways I thought it was a strange essential oil diffuser until she told me what it was. I was being paid to play with them for an hour but she found out that I was actually staying for two or three hours. When she asked me about it I think I said something like I'd want someone to do the same for my dog. Ever since then she leaves me treats in the kitchen and even got me a Christmas present from the dogs. She leaves you treats. You're now also her dog. I got a nanny cam to keep an eye out for my elderly grandfather, especially when the home aides were there. My grandfather started asking for lots of cash and couldn't remember what was happening to it. A brooch that my aunt was supposed to get disappeared. And then I heard reports of my grandfather being inappropriate with the some of the home health aides. He was busted squirreling away his medication that he was supposed to be taking in his chair, giving money to an aide and sexually harassing another aide. She stole a single puzzle piece of what we were trying to solve. Saw her put it in her pocket. Final straw was one of our f potted plants. The family I nanny for told me that the previous nanny got caught doing loads of awful things. The couple that outraged me most were one leaving their three-year-old daughter in the tub with water up to her chest for two hours every day while she sat in another room unable to see said child. And two once she went to run an errand with the same kid. And the doorbell camera caught her putting kid in car seat, not buckling her, and peeling off. The mom said you could see toddler trying to buckled herself in before they took off. I have caught her making pillow forts that are heavily resistant to the monsters that may or may not come out during heavy thunderstorms with my kiddo, 20 minutes after bedtime, needless to she was dealt with appropriately. I was the kiddo. My mom often tells the story of how she watched me give a big ol' hug to my babysitter who just broke down out of nowhere after serving me lunch. Turns out her dad had died a month back and it just wasn't a good day for her. I still remember you, Moors. Yancey, I hope you're doing just fine now. Not mine, but my friends. We watched her daughter's nanny playing with her, singing to her and just being so lovely. She was so good, that all the other's mums wanted to hire her. Not a parent. Was up having the time of her life destroying my PlayStation. Friend caught hers rummaging through her closet and stealing a blouse. She confronted her about it when she returned home, and the woman played innocent. She was wearing the f blouse. She picked up our pug Doogie and was dancing around the living room with him while that hey, I just met you song was playing. What I learned today, Redditors have more dogs than kids if not equal. Not me, but my aunt and uncle had CCTV cams installed in the house. One of them caught their nanny sexually abusing my toddler cousin and their one-year-old or so baby. This was a few years ago. Luckily they were young enough to not have very lasting memories Jesus I hope so. The parents sent them to experts for therapy sessions. So I hope they're a little to no lasting damage. I house dog sit for friends of my parents. 
The first time I did it they mentioned they had a security camera by the front door that was motion activated, and I didn't really think anything of it. They were gone for a few weeks. They come home. The two giant huskies are happy. I get paid and all was well. A couple weeks later my mom calls me laughing and laughing. My parents had dinner with the friends I dog sit for and they showed a video to my parents from the front door cam. Apparently all it showed was me sprinting full speed down the hallway. A dog toy in hand. Biggest stupid grin on my face. Followed by the two huskies running and sliding after me. Followed by me. Followed by the huskies. Over and over and over and over again. I sit for them as often as I can. Put my child to bed and had a friend over and masturbated on the couch together. Well a case which happened near where I live. Woman used to work. Husband out of country. Had a two-year-old kid. They hired a nanny to look after him during daytime. Day by day kid started looking malnourished. So she set up a spy cam. Apparently the lady used to bring her kid and feed him all the food left for the kid she was supposed to babysit. Then she would feed the kid cheap biscuits. She was promptly handed over to police. Sitting on our couch playing with the dogs like we paid them to. Farting loudly. 